What's up, guys? Well, I haven't made any herping videos in a while, and because uh, I haven't found anything, and I haven't even been out. Been busy. Got band camp. Um, but yeah, my mom was delivering mail one day, and she uh, happened to find this guy when delivering mail. Um, I came home after band camp, and. Uh, there he, and he was in the, he was inside in a mail cart and waiting for me. My mom uh, put him in there. She's found like three already this season, and, and uh, never actually kept one long enough for me to make a video on it. Um, so yeah, this is an eastern box turtle. Um, you probably can't even see very well, but I'll upload some pictures. Um, this is a guy. Uh, a couple different ways you can tell. Um, one is, this video, like I said, doesn't do the best of, uh, best justice for it here, but, um, he has a red, he has a red eye, which means a guy, um, he's very bright in color with his legs and everything, um, there's scales on his legs, and another thing that you can determine the gender is, uh, this bottom part of the shell here, um, it's indented. And when it's in Denon, that means that it is a boy. Um, if there's a bulge there, that's a girl. Also, uh, right there, there's the tail. Um, he hasn't stuck his tail out yet. Maybe I can get him to later. But, uh, but yeah, that's... Um, usually they're more... Uh, they're thicker at the base than females for males. Um, this guy... I tried counting his age. I got about 16 or 16, well, like between 14 and 17, I think. Um, they age like trees. With every year, they get a new ring that grows in. Um, I Different places on his body gave me, or on his shell, gave me different numbers. Um, or maybe I just miscounted. So uh, when I upload some pictures, maybe you guys can tell me. How old do you think he is? Um, this guy's about about the size of my hand. Probably about good seven inches. Um, he's got these. Uh, he has this ridged shell here, and that helps him hide from predators. He can uh, go into a shell, like all like like turtles. He goes into a shell. Um, these guys are native to. Uh, as their name implies, the eastern United States. Um, they have a high domed carapace, the top part of the shell. It's very, it's very high. It's tall. It's pretty tall for turtles. Um, these guys are, these guys are uh, a species of special concern um, in Pennsylvania. They are native to my county, Lancaster County. They're. Uh, um, they have been, they're abundant here, I guess I guess you could say. Um, you know, I, people see them all the time here, and this is actually the first time I've seen one all season. Um, I've made, a, I've made like, I don't know, like 10, 10, 11 herping videos, but usually they're all salamanders, but I finally found something other than a salamander. Um, and just take a look at this guy's cool coloration. And I'll, I'll and I'll, uh, put some pictures with my Nikon camera on there too. This will be better. Um, you find these guys in deciduous woodlands, which is where I am. And there's a campsite. Um, old fields, pastures, and marshy areas, swamps, uh, between, um, look at him looking around there. Yeah, you can find him you can find these guys like basically anywhere around here. Um, this guy has some pretty cool coloration. Nothing too out of the ordinary. Uh, pretty interesting though. Um, these guys will eat basically. Um, I guess these guys you can call them omnivores. Uh, they eat plants and lettuce, um, but they also eat earthworms, snails. Uh, yeah, you want to watch out for those back claws there. 
pretty sharp. Um, and that's another thing. These uh, these claws also indicate that he's a male. These sharp claws. They almost, yeah. Um, when uh, the male actually mounts the female, he has this dome here so that he can fit over the top. Just makes it easier. It's kind of gross, I know, but but yeah, that's just a fact about them. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much it for information on this guy. Um, hmm. For once, I actually found something I actually know a little bit about, which is nice. But uh, this guy is trying to let him trying to get away before the video is over. Um, I decided to name him uh, Bill Bill Slowski after the uh, Comcast Slowskis. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to let him go. All right, see ya.